guys, what's up? LD Shyality here and welcome to episode 3 of One Life, the hardcore Minecraft series where you only get one life. So it is a really good job that we got this obsidian armor and this advanced iron sword in the last episode. Now, today I'm going to be working on my house. And what people don't realize is that building a house is actually the most dangerous thing that you can do in Minecraft. First you've got to gather all the materials and then you have to climb up really high. There are just so many ways to die when building a house so we have to be really careful. I had so many really cool suggestions in the comments last episode. A lot of people suggested a Rapunzel tower but the theme I'm going to go for is Mermaid Palace and it's gonna be super bright and colorful so we need to collect some super bright and colorful blocks. Now the blocks I'm looking for are these clay shingles. I think they look so cool. I want to get some pink ones and also some light blue ones. So we're gonna need a lot of clay. Now luckily over here I saw a mesa biome. So hopefully I can steal some of the clay. Oh, hang on. We're gonna need this to make the magenta die. Yes, let's take all of these babies. They're so pretty. It feels bad destroying them, but I need them for my experiments. Now, last episode, I did stumble across this house, which kind of freaked me out because it is so close to mine. But you guys in the comments helped me solve the mystery. It is actually Stacy's house, and I don't want to really ruin the nice area that she has here. So I'm gonna see if I can find some clay over here that I can take and she won't notice. Okay, I think over here is far enough away. We just need loads and loads of clay. Oh, at first I felt kind of bad for ruining the landscape here, but then I remembered it's the same place as these stupid cacti. I don't care about destroying this anymore. I want it all gone. How could Stacy choose to live in a place like this? Okay, I think I maybe got a little carried away and collected too much clay. This is probably more than enough now, so we should head back and start crafting. You know, I think I'm actually gonna need more magenta dye. So I'm just gonna snatch up all these flowers on my way home. Okay, just as it's getting dark, we're getting home just in time to craft. Okay, so we've got loads of magenta clay. Now we just need to turn that into the shingles, which is done like so. And now we have a load of stacks of shingles and they, oh! You scared me. So now I can show you how beautiful they are. Wow, look at that. It's like clay, but better. So this is the main color that I want to build my house out of. So I'm gonna make a chest to store all these materials in. And I'm gonna put it over here while we collect the others. So the other colors I wanted are light blue and yellow. So we need to get some light blue dye. Okay, we need to find some blue flowers and some yellow flowers. So let's go. Oh, found some yellow flowers already. Lucky me. And I'm sure there are some blue flowers around here somewhere. Okay, I seem to not be able to find any blue flowers. Okay, where the higgledy heck are all the blue flowers? Maybe they're in here. This is a really cute looking biome. Oh, some yellow flowers. I'll take it. Okay, I failed to find a single blue flower, but look at that, dancing skeleton horse. What a thing to marvel at. Oh, look what I found. It's my first ever house. What a pathetic little shack I was living in. I gotta blow that up one day with TNT, but that is way too dangerous. <gasps> Who's that? There's a wolf. Hello, do I have any bones? <gasps> I have eight bones. Shall I tame you? Why are you running away from me? Come back here. Hey, don't you want to be tamed? Oh, yes, I have a wolf now. Oh, there's another one. Okay, we are going to have a pack of wolves. They are going to keep me safe forever. Unless this one is greedy. Oh, thank goodness. Okay, we have two wolves. Hang on. Is that poison ivy? I think it is poison ivy. Oh, but I need to get the blue flowers. I'm just going to have to do this. Eliminate the threat, collect the flowers. Imagine if that isn't even poison ivy and I'm just being ridiculous. Spoiler alert, that's not poison ivy. Oh, I'm so scared. That's poison ivy, so let's go around it. Hopefully my dogs don't get poisoned. Why is there so much poison ivy around these blue flowers that I want? This is dangerous work. You have to be a brave lad to do this. Okay, maybe it's not poison ivy because my dogs are just running around in it. <gasps> oh gosh, I nearly got close to it. I think I, I think I stood on it and it didn't do anything, but maybe I didn't. Oh, wait, that's poison ivy. Okay, now I'm just confused. 
Okay, I'm gonna have to go back to spawn and have a look at the little signs that were posted telling us what thorns and poison ivy look like. Okay, here's the starting area. So, poison ivy looks like that. Okay, so I was avoiding the wrong thing, but somehow managed to not step in any of the poison ivy anyway, and thorns look like that. Dang, they both just look like grass. How are you meant to avoid this stuff, dude? <sighs> How are you still alive? I've already died once. You haven't even got a sword. Right, well, now we know. Uh-oh, it got dark, and I am not home yet. Okay, hopefully there's nothing that wants to kill me around here. I think we're good. Okay, where are my wolves? Oh no, they're on the outside. Guys, get in here. Guys, quick. Just get in there. Oh, thank goodness. Welcome home, boys. Okay, I really ought to build a bigger house before I start collecting more pets. So, let's get crafting. I'm gonna need 14 pieces of the yellow clay. So, that should be plenty. So, there we go. And we're also gonna make some light blue with the leftover clay. Ta-da! Now, let's start building around... <gasps> Creeper! Oh, no, you don't. Not near my house. I haven't even built it yet. You aren't gonna blow it up. Okay, let's grab my pink stuff so we can start constructing. It's gonna look so cool. Okay, so here is the outline shape of the house. So we just need to start building it up to create the walls. Now I'm starting to realize that perhaps I might not actually have enough clay, but we shall see. Okay guys, I'm starting to get really high up now. Do you see why I said that building a house is the most dangerous thing you can do in Minecraft? I am serious, guys. This is some risky business. <gasps> I told you. And now I only have two hearts. I don't know how I'm gonna stay alive after episode five if I can't even build a wall without dying. I was trying to be so careful too. Okay, I ran out of blocks, so... <laughs> Oh dear. And so I have to craft some more. Okay, we've got another stack. Now the question is, can we finish this wall without dying? Almost there. I've done it. We have completed phase one. Now we need to make it look pretty. So let's make some of the light blue shingles. And out of those, I'm gonna make some stairs. And now this is the tricky bit. I want to place these on this wall, kind of like that. So they're sticking out and it should have a nice kind of palace castle -y vibe. So that's gonna go all the way around. So wish me luck. 12 seconds later. Two hours later. Okay, that looks good. Now I want to add the beautiful yellow clay blocks and I'm going to add them right here on the front of my house. Ta-da! How cute is that? It's a little star on my house. Now I think I actually really love the contrast of the orange and the pink, so I'm gonna collect more of the orange wood to do a roof up there so I can stand up there and snipe the skeletons. So let's collect more of this beautiful acacia wood. Now are there any better looking ladders? Oh, nope. What is a step ladder? What, what the heck is that? What the heck is this? How do you use this? Oh my gosh. Oh, how cute. That is freaking adorable. Wow, that's actually so cool. Really handy, but not really what I need right now. Okay, let's just use this for now to get up on the roof. And I'm just gonna build this out. Look how colorful it is. If this doesn't scare off all the mobs, I don't know what will. Okay, there we go. And let's light this place up so that it doesn't become a huge mob spawner. Let's get down from here. Now this place is starting to take shape, but we definitely need some windows so we can actually see outside. That means we're gonna need sand, which means we're going to need a shovel. So I'm gonna make myself an iron shovel because I am fancy and head over to the beach. Okay, we've almost excavated the whole beach. So let's head back. I've got a couple of stacks. Let's get these bad boys smelting. Ta-da! Okay, let's cut some holes where we want these windows then. I want to make them kind of look like a bolt of lightning. So, like that. 
Oh, how adorable. Then one on the other side to make it symmetrical. Oh, yes. Now let's put the glass in place so it's nice and safe. Now I also want to put some windows on the side around here that are identical. And I'm going to do a little star-shaped window over here. There we go. Now I still have my safe house within my house right now because the entrance is not secure. I know you guys hate it when I don't use doors. So I think we should use an iron door because that is the only thing that is going to keep the zombies out on a blood moon. And a blood moon is a rare occurrence at night where it won't let you sleep in your bed and all the mobs get super powerful. So basically you just want to hide in your house. So let's make sure that we will be able to safely hide inside the house. For now, I am just gonna create a tiny doorway with a little iron door. Dang it, I'm stuck on the outside. I don't have a button. Dang it. Let's create a button first. Oh, we're gonna need a button on the other side too. We're gonna need two buttons. Okay, we now have a functional door that should stop the zombies out unless they know how to use buttons. In which case, we're all gonna die. So this will do for now. So that means I can now deconstruct my little house. You guys are gonna be free. Give me all my wood back. Okay, that is my house gone. Now we have a lot of space to work with. Now I'm also gonna make a ladder that will go up to the roof just in case we need to get up there. You know, in case we need to escape or something. So let's place these ladders all the way up. Okay, Stacy. And through the roof. Wow, it's really scary up here. I can look down on all the scary things like that spider and those creepers. Oh my gosh, so many things. This would be a great place to come to kill them from afar because I don't think they can get to me. But we are definitely not ready for that yet, so we are gonna sleep away the night. Oh look, Stacy's online and she says good morning. It is a good morning. Look at my beautiful windows. Oh, is that a zombie? There's a zombie dying out there. Now one of the things I really wanted to add to my house was a pair of wings on the outside. So, if this guy doesn't kill me... Ah! Oh, ah! Oh, there's something chasing me. Oh my gosh, what is it? What is it? What is it? It's a freaking chicken! Okay. Run for the house! Oh! Ah! Oh, ah! It's in here with me! Oh my goodness, okay, maybe the iron door was not such a great idea. I don't know how to use buttons properly. Oh, okay, we now have even fewer hearts. But that's fine, because soon my house will have wings. Now, I could make them out of regular wool, but I found this really cute quilted wool down here, which just looks adorable, but you need string. So, I'm gonna try and kill as many spiders as I can with my one and a half hearts left. Oh man, all the spiders are gone, what the heck? Okay, where else can I get string from? I can get string from cotton, oh my gosh. Okay, if we can get some cotton plants going, we can get some string. Now we're also gonna need wool, so I'm just gonna shear all of the sheep around here. So I have a lot of shearing and farming to do. Now where do I get cotton from? <gasps> Hang on. There's some cotton, okay. You can keep your parsnips and your winter squash. I only want the cotton. Right, let's start a farm. I need a hoe and my bucket. Should I start the farm in here or would that be ridiculous? I'm gonna start the farm in here where it's nice and safe for now. So hopefully that will grow and I will have an unlimited supply of string. <laughs> Plus there are tons of sheep around here so we should have wings in no time. Oh, I just remembered I was supposed to be building a mermaid palace, not an angel palace. Oh well, it's the best of both worlds. Mermaid colors, angel wings. Let's try and collect some more of the cotton. Nope, that's not cotton. Ooh, more. We're gonna have so much string, I could start selling it. Let's get this planted. Grow, you're gonna be my fortune. I'll leave you to it. So let's check if we have any string already. We have two pieces five pieces and that's it so we can make a couple of pieces of quilted wool and it looks like this isn't it pretty oh i love it but we need more now let's put it in there for now until we collect more now while we wait i really want to try and figure out how to make and use a shield because we are in 1.11.2 now which means shields are a thing so so let's see how to make one 
Oh, there's a wooden shield. And then there's an advanced shield. Wow, that uses blocks of iron and logs and a normal shield though. Let's just go for a normal shield for now and we'll test it out. Wow, look at me. Okay, how do I hold it with my sword though? Ooh, okay, I have my shield. So if I hold it up, it'll block the attack and then I can hit, block, hit, block, hit, block. I don't think this is gonna work, but let's try it out. Oh gosh, hello, is there anyone here? Oh, there's a zombie over there. I think I'll just go and say hello. I'm scared. This is a terrible idea. Will he, will he hurt me? Ah, I don't want to risk it. Well, I didn't really use the shield, but that was fun. <gasps> a spider. I need your string. Oh no, oh no. I forgot how, <gasps> oh, he hit me. He hit me through the shield, I think. Or maybe I'm using it wrong. I don't know, but I got hurt. Oh. I'm so sad. I failed. I failed on my mission. Oh, dang. I'm not going out in the nighttime anymore. Okay, maybe I'll just stay in here until I have more hearts. <laughs> Ooh, is this grown yet? Oh, <gasps> it is. I got more cotton. Okay, let's plant this. Wow. Infinite string. Here I come. I think I'm going to need more wool. Taking my shield with me just in case. Just to shield me from the sheep's nudity after I shear it. Shield yourself. My cotton farm is in full swing now and we actually have quite a bit of cotton so we can start making this into quilted wool. Ta-da! Now I would love to go out and start making the wings but I can hear a little baby skeleton out here. I'm pretty sure he's just outside the window so look there he is on the other side of that block. Okay so my plan is really stupid but this is what I'm gonna do. Come at me! Come on in! Where, where is he? Oh, there he is. Ugh. Oh, he's dead. I did it. But we defeated him. Look at his little poison arrows. I'm confiscating those. Let's fix my house back up and let's make the angel wings. I'm going to start on this side. So let's put the first wing over here and it's going to go up the side of the house. Let's try and do this without falling off. That would be nice. Now let's see how it looks. Ooh, so cute, but it's a little bit lopsided. We need one on that side now. Let's go. I'm gonna have to get rid of this tree. It is in the way. I need to spread my wings and fly. Sorry, tree. Uh-oh, I think we're gonna run out of blocks. Yep, we're gonna run out. Let's get more cotton. There we go. Let's have a little look. <gasps> oh, she's beautiful. There are, some there are some more things I want to add later, but I'm going to have to go to the nether. So I think I'll do that next time. So, oh my gosh, I just got scared by you. So next we are going to need some better flooring. This grass is just not appropriate. So the flooring I would like is this light blue stained plank. So we're going to need a lot of planks and also some light blue dye. I think I still have some left over. Oh my gosh, I have loads. So let's just make eight for now and make sure that we like the look of it. See what this looks like in this corner over here. Oh yes, I love that color. Looks so cute with the pink. I need more. Okay, we only have 48. I don't think that's enough to do this entire floor. Oh, this is so much better than the grass. Okay, we need more. I'm gonna have to chop down some trees. I'm gonna chop this tree down here because it's ruining my beautiful wing. All right, just in time for the sun to go down. So it's time to hide in my house. Okay, that should be enough. Actually, it probably won't be. Okay, I need to go get some more wood. But there's a spider out here, so let's just avoid... <gasps> it's a baby spider. No! Oh gosh, we have an infestation. Code red. Abandon the house. Well, it was nice while it lasted. I think it's time to find a new house. <laughs> just kidding. All my stuff is in there. Where is it? Where'd it go? Ah! Oh my gosh! It's up there! What the heck? Okay, I have a plan. This is the plan. Ah! Come back up. And I hit you! He's dead. Okay. Thank goodness. Now, hopefully the mummy spider is not mad, although she seems to have disappeared, which is never a good sign. My worst nightmare, in fact. Okay, now let's retreat into the safety of our home. 
can finish off the floor. It's important that we have a proper floor before we can even think about trying to survive past episode 5. Hopefully this will be enough to finish. Nope, I was wrong. We need yet more wood. Okay, we're starting to run out of trees. I'm going all the way over here. There's something in the grass. Ah! Oh my gosh! It's a little bunny! It's so tiny! Hey, little guy. Now, I better not get too close, because knowing this mod pack, it's probably going to kill me. So let's just mind our own business and pop down a tree over here. Oh, man. Who's the dingback that left all these floating trees? It was probably me, wasn't it? <gasps> Is that a little baby squid? Hello. I want to give him a little tickle. Hopefully, he doesn't attack me. <gasps> what? Oh, my gosh. He made me blind. Dude, that was awesome. Oh. That's so cute, he inked on me. We should probably stop doing dangerous things. Let's just carry on with the floor as safely as possible. And maybe we'll even finish it this century. That would be great. I think I've made too many planks now. Okay, I'm gonna leave that farm there for now because it's really good for getting string, which I want to use to make a bow. So let's try and make one now. There we go. And now I'm gonna collect all my arrows. I have, oh, I only have five. <laughs> Let's test it out. Yeah. Wait, what the heck? Oh, <gasps> I accidentally fired one of the nausea arrows. Oh my gosh. Wow. Um, is that just going to be there forever? Because I probably shouldn't have done that inside the house. Let's put this bow away for now and move on. Now, as you guys know, after episode five, we are not allowed to die. If we do, we are off the server. So you guys gave me a load of tips in the comments last time. And one of them was to start a strip mine under my house, which I think is a fantastic idea. So that is what we're gonna do. There we go, that should be enough ladders to get us down to level 13. Okay, we made it all the way down to level nine and then we ran out of ladders. So this is where we will stop and we'll mine out from here. Oh, we already found some redstone. Now I just wanna make sure that we can actually find some diamonds down here and then I will be happy. <gasps> is that gold? That is even better than diamonds. Oh, I really needed some gold. Oh, there's so much of it too. Oh, give me, give me it all. Okay, I think we have enough for a whole golden apple now. Girl, I can be as risky as I want. But I would like to find some diamonds too, because I'm just greedy. Uh-oh, is that? Ugh, a cave. What are you supposed to do when you find a cave in your strip mine? Do you just ignore it or do you investigate? Well, I know what I'm going to do. Bat! Bat! Death, death to all bats. Stupid. Gold. So worth it. Oh, this was a great idea. Hello. Oh, yoo-hoo. Anyone hiding any diamonds in here? <gasps> Ooh, lapis. That could come in handy for enchanting. Definitely need to take this with me. Oh, gosh, gravel. Okay, let's go back into the strip mine. I'm not all about that cave life anymore. I am about strip mining. Oh, oh, lava, lava, stop it. Stop, stop the lava. Oh, dear. Okay, that's enough strip mining for one day, but I will be back. Two hours later. So it turns out that I actually really like mining and I spent the last two hours gathering resources. So here we are. We now have a bunch of cobblestone, some clay I found down here, redstone, loads of lapis, some rubies, iron, gold, diamonds. Oh my goodness, there's so much. So I think what I'm gonna do with all this is actually make an enchanting table so that I can get a better iron pickaxe with fortune or something. Then I can get even more resources when I mine. So we're gonna need obsidian again, two diamonds and a book to make the enchanting table. So let's grab all of this precious stuff and take it up to the surface and get to work on an enchanting area. Uh-oh, it's nighttime. Okay, where's my bed? <gasps> I left it down there. Ah, oh, make a new one. Oh, I don't have enough. I don't have anything to make a bed with. Oh wait, there's a spare bed right here. Okay, <laughs> panic over. Now let's make a fresh diamond pickaxe because my other one broke. And I'm going to head out and try and find stuff. Oh! <gasps> oh, sweet mama jeez. He's right there. I can't believe that just happened. I can't believe I'm still alive. What the heck? Looks like we need that bow and arrow now. I have just the plan to take care of that chap. I shouldn't have built this ledge on my house. Ah. Oh! oh my gosh, he sees me. He knows I'm here. Oh my gosh, there's another one there. Get out of here. 
Oh no, I'm gonna run out of arrows. Okay, we got him. <gasps> there he is. Get him! He's dead, he's dead. We killed him, we did it. Oh, now it is safe to leave the house. Now, just need to find some sugar cane and I can be on my merry way with my half a heart. I'm pretty sure there was some sugar cane over here somewhere. I remember seeing it a long, long time ago. <gasps> there it is. A little lonely piece of sugar cane waiting just for me next to the very dangerous quicksand. Oh, I got it. Is there any more? Nope, that's it. Okay, well, I'll take what I can get. I guess we'll just have to start a little farm so we can get more. Luckily, farming is not quite as dangerous as fighting skeletons, so I should be able to survive for just a little longer. We can definitely get rid of some of this cotton now. I can't imagine I'm ever going to need this much string. There we go. Let's plant this and just wait. Actually, we should probably be getting the obsidian while we wait. So let's head over here. Need some water. And now I just need to find that lava. Oh, here is some lava. Okay, here we go. Okay, let's grab them. I'm going as fast as I can. Hopefully night doesn't fall while I'm still here. Okay, I've got all my obsidian now. So we are halfway to making the enchanting table. Oh wait, I also need leather. So let's see if there are any cows around. Oh, <gasps> there they are. I'm coming for you. Ha! I'm sorry. I really desperately need the leather. I need as many books as I can get. Okay. I'd say mission accomplished, but I don't think we really accomplished much. At least I can make a book now though. Some paper and make a book, finally. Now we can craft the enchanting table. Ta-da! Ooh, doesn't it look fancy? Now, would you excuse me please, Mr. Boney? This is exactly where I wanted to place the enchanting table. Ta-da! Wow, and then I'm gonna surround it with books and it will look so cool. And the bookshelves that I want to make are actually these rainbow ones. We should try and make the birch ones. I think that looks cuter. So we need birch wood stairs. I haven't actually seen any birch trees, so we should go and find some. Birch trees, I'm looking for you. If a zombie chicken so much as sneezes on me, I am dead. So let's try to avoid those then. I can't believe I've been alive for so long, to be honest. I definitely thought I would have died again by now. You probably also thought that, and I don't blame you. Ooh, the llamas are back. Hello, I'm not going to kill you. Unless you drop leather. No, I won't kill you. And I will not kill these... Or will I? Yep, I'm going to kill the horses. I'm sorry. I know Stacy plays on this server, and this will probably be really upsetting for her. So please don't tell her, but I really need the leather. So many horses. I'll kill the ugly ones first. I'm sorry. Ooh, sugar cane. Today's my lucky day. Horse killing and sugar cane. What more could a girl ask for? Ooh, there's a birch tree. Gimme, 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 gimme. Okay, I've learned that that is not actually poison ivy. What we do have to worry about is actual poison ivy, which also could be around here somewhere. We have a lot of birch wood now. Perhaps we should take home a sapling, just in case. Let's retreat back to the safety of our house, because I have everything I came for now. Oh, is there a bat out in the open? What is it doing out here? Oh gosh, it's probably looking for its next victim. Well, it won't be me, sir. Not today. Oh, just in time for nightfall. I'll be home and back in my bed in no time. Maybe we'll be there a little bit past my bedtime, but that should be fine. We should still survive. Okay, I'm in. I'm good. I'm safe. I'm alive. Let's sleep. Tucked in my bed like a little snuggly bunny. Now, I suppose I should start by planting this birch tree outside in case I run out of wood. And then I can make the staircases. Ta-da! Okay, I have plenty now, I think. But we still need a load of books. And this hasn't flipping grown! Whatever, it's fine. I can still make a few books. There we go. But let's take a look how cute this bookshelf is. Okay, here we go. Ta-da! Oh, it's adorable. I love the rainbow. I think it's gonna suit this place really nice. So that is where I'm gonna leave it for this episode of One Life. I'm gonna finish up my enchanting area before next episode, and then we can head to the nether. I'm very scared. So I will see you in the next episode.